viewers and subscribers, bless up on yourself. And remember, always put God first in everything you want to do. I'm your host, El Chapasca TV. We keep you informed. Details in the news today are senior citizen among four shot in St. Andrew. Two goat farmers found dead in bushes. Reason why pregnant girl get killed in downtown Kinson. Remember, subscribe, comment and share. Keep that post notification on to always be updated by El Chapa Scott. Short breaking news. Stay tuned. So forward. I'm at the house. I'm here talking to my representative. El Chapa Scott TV. El Chapa Dentum of Vento Trap Move. Hurricane Breeze. All the mat move. So viewers and subscribers, this is a moment to everybody out yet, man. Cops investigate whether jealousy, revenge, motivate murder of pregnant woman. Police sources have shared two theories. One of them jealousy, which could have led to the murder of 26-year-old Shantiva Griffiths on Orange Street in downtown Kingston. On Monday about 6.30 p.m., Griffiths was pregnant at the time she was shot in the head multiple times by a gunman. The Jamaica Observer was told, Yesterday, a police source who requests said one of the Leeds investigators are exploring is that Griffiths was threatened many times to abandon her employment at a store. According to the source, Griffiths, who was put in charge of managing and supervising the store, had a fire worker. Zimmy so them and say, oh, she fire a worker. You get me because the bigger boss then put Griffiths to be a supervisor, supervise the store. However, the source also said that police are investigating the possibility that a farmer female companion of the store owner who was sidelined by the businessman may have ordered the gruesome killing in revenge. She controlled the business place. A girl got fired so it is between that girl and the boss first girlfriend who used to eat out the business and run it down. Word is that woman loved to gamble and could not buy back stock for the store, the cop said. Griffiths came into the business now and started to do the right thing. She is from the Harborview area. She told people that she was going to stop at a friend's drink out. Somebody must have made a phone call. How else would they know when she was going to walk and where she was going to walk? Even in your workplace, you have people who will laugh and talk with you and still keep up slackness against you, the cop said. Griffith's killing was yesterday condemned by woman's right. Advocate Nadine Spence. And Nadine Spence said, every day you get up and hope that things are getting better and that some things are making a difference and that the different tragedies are working. But every day you wake up, something else happens that throws you further into despair and just sheer hopelessness, Spence said. Hearing that a pregnant woman at 26 years old was shot, it leaves you breathless. You wonder who is safe in Jamaica and you start begin to wonder when it will be your turn. None of us seem safe for this one in particular. It is really shocking, Spence added. So viewers and subscribers, Spence is one of our co-workers, one of our friends. She named Nadine Spence and she just attack our belief and our opinion about this situation. However, them said Griffiths, who became the supervisor of that store downtown, had an individual fire. You see me? But nevertheless, even if you fire an individual, you know, for just get up and send shots for make somebody kill, even though we're not sure if a she do it, you know, but end of the day, of viewers and subscribers, you know. The match I show you said that happening at the same period of time when she get fire. So you know, so the mother have she upon the suspect list. And it still can be somebody else. It not to be the girl that get fired. It still can be a next individual in the store to take up things upon them head or some planning go on. So the police them have it as say yo, it's either jealousy cause or death, or it's just a reprisal about the individual that get fired. Judge. Senior citizen among four shot in St. Andrew. A senior citizen was one of four persons who were shot and injured on Fitzgerald Avenue, close to Maxfield Avenue in St. Andrew yesterday afternoon. The incident occurred about 2 p.m. According to a resident, the man had just collected his pension at the Whitfield Town Post Office and was walking along the roadway when he was shot. Someone said, "Me feel sorry for the old man because he's not run at all. You see, when the man leave off the police office step, and then the car just drive down and shot the man. He couldn't even run and his poor bones can't even set. 
the man them not care at all because they must say it's an elderly person get shot, he said. The St. Andrew South Police have confirmed that all four persons turned up at the Kinson Public Hospital with gunshot wounds, were in stable condition, an officer on the scene said the incident could be part of a long-standing feud in the area. It is reported that the gunmen who were travelling in a grey Toyota Voxy drove along Maxwell Avenue and began firing at a group of people and allegedly eyewitness said the sole female that was shot was in the wrong place at the wrong time. The lady will get shot in her vagina or near the part that just run a little stall. Me honestly run. Not think she was the target, but because when the shots start fire, the men them a try escape so them run towards her stall. And so she gets shot. She's a big woman too and she recently did an operation and put in a pacemaker. Now this, the resident said. The resident told the star that this incident have left them covering in fear and they implore the police to maintain a strong presence in the area. The police are here a lot of times but the man them work off a phone call so them are always two step ahead of the police shots. Always two what? Two step of the police. So to use fire the security post them there but now things are get rougher. Me a beg the police them to just stay here because I want a peaceful Christmas right now. I'm afraid to come on my window, a resident told the star. So viewers and subscribers, hell broke loose in a Maxfield. If them cannot kill all, what am I going to do with somebody where young? Fury, chaos are going on in a Maxfield. And the people them are crying a ball for the police them come stay put. The people them want the police them for stay put and whole post like security because what them scared hmm. god two goat farmers found dead in bushes with hands bound the westmoreland police are probing the grizzly killing of two goat farmers whose bodies were found in bushes with their hands bound and what appeared to be gunshot wounds on tuesday morning the deceased men have been identified as 65-year-old Henry Jones and 42-year-old Brian Chambers, both of Crowder, Grangeil in the parish. Reports on the police are that about 8.45 am, the two bodies were discovered in the bushes in the Mint Road area of Grangeil. Both men reportedly left their homes around 6 am on Monday with roughly 200 sheep and goats. Later that afternoon, residents became suspicious when some of the animals returned but the farmers didn't. The police were called on a search launch. Four goats identified as some of the farmers' missing goats were found in the Peggy Berry section of Grangeil. The search for the farmers however proved futile on Monday. Their bodies were discovered Tuesday morning with their hands tied up behind them after the police and residents resumed the search. So you see what I go on viewers and subscribers is like the individual, the villain them capture the farmer them and tie them up. You get me? Tie them up, execute them, and most likely capture some of them goat or something like that. You know, people, people, people. Why people not sweat for them things? Why people just want to confiscate your own? Cha cha. I'm your boy, Chopper Scott TV. We keep you informed. Please, viewers and subscribers, share the link to our friend so our friend can know our gun. You see me? Bless up on yourself and take care. And at Christmas, yeah. Make sure to watch out for the rabbit with them. You see me? And be safe. I'm out. Jaggy, jaggy. I'm at the house. I'm talking to my representative. El Chopper Scott TV. El Chopper, then to move into trap move. Hurricane breeze, all the mat move.